Oh. Don't make it just for kickoff. Because <laughs> it was a one o'clock kickoff, weren't it, Jay? Uh, <laughs> Good job of it, man, Jay. <laughs> so, with that, I uploaded the press out vlog late from last week, but I got another one here today. And press out of this Kimmel Bay. Big Dave. Oh, yes. <laughs> but yeah, um, game's just about to kick off. Had a nice Toby's Carvey brekkie this morning in Stony Croft. And now we've just arrived at Press Dat. Have we just made it? The wind's gonna batter me phone tonight. We've made it here at Bastion Gardens. And she said it was three more Press Dat. I think four more Press Dat. We pressed out the shooting this end as well. First half. <laughs> Dixie Davis. Back from his holiday in Thailand and all that. Fucking awful in it, the weather. It was like. Boom! The weather's jag. Press that and I've got a new keeper. Good luck to Josh. Who's left? I'll just stop that because my G. The chance. I promise I'll come. Gee. <laughs> but yeah, um, this is first time keeper is good apparently. He's a scouser again. Last week as well, the same ref. <laughs> and murdered him. Not me, but just murdered him. One of the Welsh games. It's a brilliant link up. Go ahead. McGee again. Seagull pitch 
cash invasion. Oh, watch out, Spend Dog will give you a fine. But nicely placed on the keeper. I keep hugging on the box. Good save. But quick reaction from the top. And it's 3 0. Go finish. It's unlucky from the keeper though. Keep it on well. Keep it on well with the save. The defence was slow, but Dan reacted quick. 3 0. Very much so. Where he takes his to the end. Great touch from Dan. Is it P.O.? Dixie Davis, same again from the keeper. Just started for a half time. Thanks, Jay, for letting us do that some more at full time. But yeah, it um, wasn't better than having my boots on. Oh, no, Brilliant. Oh, come ahead. Yeah, what have I done better? I like, had gloves on and stuff. I mean, Jay did offer me some gloves, but I said no. Made some good saves. Some never got recorded. Loads of beauties this game. 
Yes, that'll be on top. What a jinx. Time then, press down six. Kill okay, well, by now. Great game of football for the seasiders. And the jinx has oh, been confirmed and ended after being there for the full game. Just while I got there for kick off, get in six now. So, yeah, I'm glad you stayed for another season. Well, what do you think of today, lads? Yeah, perfect today, of course. All the new players, especially. All the minute on the job. And they're from Wolfgang Solis for next season. Finished six last year, so obviously, probably one of the time. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What are you looking forward to for next season? Um, I want to win the league next year, so that's what I'm looking forward to. At the end of the season, celebrate. What's <laughs> Mark, my words? And Div Dogs pitching, baby. Yeah. <laughs> that's it, man. Nice 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 so today we've got Gibbo. Super sub scored two goals. Yeah. How do you feel about that? Yeah, it was good. It was good to come on and score him. And that's the score, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Fantastic, lads. Do you reckon you can build up on that and get into the first team of the season and get some important goals and get some important. You know, outcomes of the season. Yeah, definitely. Got a lot of tough games, but if we can pull that into place and then it'll be great. Yeah, score goals like that. Yeah. <laughs> Finally, what's, what's your expectation for this season? And do you reckon we'll go far this season? Yeah, I think we should be aiming for top four. Um, I think that's a big push for us, and I think we're more than capable of doing it, especially with the new lads that we've got in the grades. Yeah. Completely agree. Yeah. The new lads linked up really well yeah. together. And you know, plays really well. Yeah, cheers, Frankie. Fantastic performance. Since they've got two express that and Alex and Leon. Yep. How do they feel like going to the double time distribution stadium today? Back back here. Uh it's good to be back. Press that into big part of it. Um, result was obviously not the greatest, but you're playing tier four, you're tier two, so you know it was a it was a massive gulf and clash. But we obviously said from the start that we don't learn anything from playing easy teams. So playing the best teams out there, you only learn from it. Um, good to see Jamie. Good to see that he's obviously still keep the club alive and it's uh, going well, really. So yeah, it's just a positive. Yeah, definitely. How do you reckon you'll get on in the season? And what are you just looking forward to? The next high expectations. For us, we've got to win the league. Uh, it's as simple as that. We've been two years now of transition, changing. Um, from what we had to how the club developed, what we thought was the right way to do things, which was obviously under 19s, reserve set up uh, into the first team, um, bridging gaps. Like I said, the ambition is to win the league. You've also got another ex press night in town there, in Harry, <laughs> who's a uh, reserve manager. So, um, you know, from, from a point of view from us as a club, we're looking to win not only the reserve league but the first team league as well and uh, obviously keep building yeah definitely well i wish you all the best of luck yeah well, we, you, we obviously you wish you guys as well like i said yeah, good definitely. to see jamie i mean yeah um, no i'm happy down board. towards you as well i just i just cover all this type of football like yeah yeah i'll be back down yeah, to yeah, you. Great. Great. have you seen it's that amazing. longest train station in the world yeah <laughs> i can't say it go no. ahead you say it no i can't say it for me we will get on tech <laughs> i think jamie's still here um Past four or five years, I've been heavily involved behind the scenes for Preston. No one sees what I do, uh, but Jamie regularly speaking with Jamie meetings with him and stuff. 
and he's a great bloke and I'm just happy that he's kept the club going and same I wish for starting all the best and I, I wish him they win the league this year and hopefully look for promotion like ourselves yeah definitely and, like I say great great atmosphere now in the club things are looking up for Pristat in so hopefully they keep going and keep yeah fighting. definitely and I reckon you Alex and Leon both of you can get Kimmel Bay up there as well oh, yeah, yeah that, that's our plan it's been our plan for the past two and a half years now is that we want to look for promotion we want to get up there we want to fight and we want to work and like Leon said this is the reason why we picked tougher positions so it gives us a good a good try a good 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 workout and the lads enjoy it so yeah yeah well definitely I completely agree yeah. have a very good definitely. season have a very Cheers. good day legend lad Cheers, we should get on record back to pool yesterday that don't get the best on record balls here here up the top corner there to the top right Come on. Well, what a day that was then, and what a night, or evening I should say, with the G. And it was brilliant. A fantastic performance there from Press Tatton. 6 0 win. No matter whether Kimmel Bay are fourth tier in Welsh football or not, and Press Tatton are second tier, two difference in the league. But I just think that that was a brilliant performance on Press Tatton all around. New players linking up well. Very good goals, and that McGee looks like he's going to be some player. And that link up as well with Dan Atkins, that's going to be lethal. You know, we all wish that Tom would have been there today and for the season because that link up with McGee, Tom, and Dan would have been unbelievable. But it's still going to be unbelievable. Fair dues to Tom with your goal against Flint. Happy to see you score. Well, I didn't see it, but you know, happy to see that you'd scored and a pretty good goal as well. But he's all legends and I'll be there next week for Prestaton versus Ashton Athletic. And yeah, I'll try and get as many games as I can with Prestaton, FC Bootle and all them teams. But there's a big vlog coming up in Switzerland in just less than two weeks time. And then it's Lisbon and hopefully I'm supporting Lisbon versus Villarreal and even Burnley. <laughs> Burnley. Bloody Burnley. I'm having it on now. But he's all legends. If you all enjoyed, like and subscribe. Have a bell to one. And I'll see you all soon for another vlog. Which hopefully won't be too long away. Bash!